Good afternoon, Jonan. I am pleased to be here today to present to you the 2021 MAE Outstanding Graduate Student uh, Award for the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering at UVA. Uh, I have a couple things that I'd like to say about you and about your award. Jonan, you, you're a prolific researcher. You, you are, and, and you're really an, an adept engineer. And, and you've been an active supporter of our field, the field of injury biomechanics and automobile safety. And it's truly been a pleasure to work with you over the last five, six years, six years, I guess. Um, you really embody all the qualities I could have ever asked for in a graduate student. Your, your research not only has had impact on our field, and I can already see it's gonna to continue to have impact on our field, but it also addresses some key diversity issues that I think are understudied in our field. So not only will it have impact, but it's really opening the doors to those key diversity issues. Your accomplishments have been impressive. Um, you were able to easily move through all of the graduate coursework uh, that we had for you. And even just recently with regard to the stuff you did for your dissertation, you were successful in getting two journal papers already published before your dissertation. Um, you've got three more that have moved past the first round of review, and it looks like we're ready to move forward on a sixth one. But in addition to that, you had six conference papers before, which will mean that if we can get all these done, you'll have 12 papers as a graduate student, which is just, just outstanding. Um, you won a travel grant. You were a finalist for the three-minute thesis competition which is just outstanding. It's just outstanding for you to take such a complex issue and not only be able to clarify what you're working on in just a three minute period, but do it with such mastery of, of, of the topic matter and of who you would be speaking to, which is really kind of anyone in that kind of elevator pitch competition. It's, it's truly impressive, truly impressive. Um, I, I, I think you should have won. Um, to be honest, it, it was tough at the very end there. Um, there was a lot of very good competition, but, but your, your presentation was just outstanding. And I was, I was very proud to be in the audience watching that. Um, I, I was also really taken and really excited to see your focus on kind of continuing to support undergrads here in your career at UVA. Not only did you get one, but two double WHO awards that paired you with undergraduate students to help you get involved in your research. But even after that second double WHO award, you went out and found another undergraduate um, that you brought into what you were doing. So the idea that you were not just doing your research for yourself or for your field, but you were actually starting to, to sort of head down the path of education in this research too, is just truly impressive. Um, and the last thing I want to say, because I have this picture up behind me, is you did all of that, John, I'm with this smile on your face all the time, just like you have right now. You continue to smile. You continue to show us how you can remain jovial. You can be uh, just a happy person, which just is so much better to work with. It's so much better to work with someone like that. And I think that it made our work together that much more successful. So I can't say enough about how outstanding it's been to work with you, to watch you progress over the last six years and to become the, the researcher and the engineer uh, that you are. And I can think of no one more truly deserving of this outstanding graduate student award than you, John Nahn. Thank you for everything. I don't know, is there anything you'd like to, to say? Thank you, Jason. Yeah, I, it's, it's a very moving speech. I am glad for, for everything CAB has offered me. Um, I just wanna maybe use two, three minutes to share my perspective in this five and a half years. So, so first, I, I'm really grateful to you because you brought me in to this country as a grad student. I was, I am still just a foreign boy, you know, I didn't really know too many things around here. 
and then remembering the very beginning when we're having meetings in the cab, when people are talking across each other, I just lost track of what you guys are talking about. And in the end of the meeting, you asked me, do you know what you have to do this week? I said, I don't, to be honest. <laughs> It's it's too much to take in, and you were being so patient and just list all the action items and telling me, do you understand this and that? But things things definitely got better um, as I, I've been here for longer and keep keep thinking and keep studying. Um, yeah, I I think I'm really grateful for you to UVA to give me all these opportunities um, to improve myself, to always challenge myself, to step out of my comfort zone, for example attending the three million thesis using a foreign language to talk about research in three minutes. So, so it doesn't really matter whether I win or not, but I think it really mattered to me that I volunteered to, to try it. Um, that, that's, that's the courage I hope I have. So thank you very much. And uh, I'm glad I moved past all the process, the dissertation, the call, the classes, and uh, really ready for ready for the PhD on Friday and no surprises in between. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That's great, John. Thanks again. It's again, it's been a truly a pleasure and you are very, very deserving of this outstanding award. So congratulations. Thank you. Thank you for nominating me. Um, 